the laboratory. The loo, water closets. Bog, Donny, Nettie, shithouse, John, privy, crapper, comfort room, the porcelain throne. All these names have one thing in common. They are the bathroom. Yes, the bathroom. We go to the bathroom every single day, every single hour, every single minute to do our business. Now, I have a side note story for you all, which pisses me the hell off that people do this in public restrooms. Here is the public bathroom PSA. All right, so some of you know that whenever, not some of you, all of you, holy shit, <laughs> no pun intended. When you use the public bathroom, I don't know if you come across this because I come across this all the time. You know, you're minding your own business when you're going to the bathroom, right? You just want some peace, some quiet, and then all of a sudden, someone is violently trying to open your door, your stall door, or just like, if you're in a one person bathroom, the door, and it scares the crap out of you. I understand if you try opening the door and it's locked, get that. But when you try to like violently open the door, kind of like this, like clearly there's someone in there and then you knock what you think like no one's in there if the door is locked i don't i don't get it why do you do that there's people that do that all the time especially really ignorant kids and then they start pounding on the door and knocking scaring the shit out of you and you're like it's taken and they still like try to violently open the door and you're just kind of like what the hell i'm in here i'm not gonna like pee any quicker you know when we were in las vegas all of the stalls had a vacant sign on it to show whether or not somebody is in that stall and that was great that was helpful i wish that was in like every single bathroom that it was in but you know there's always those ignorant ass when the door is clearly locked, they decide to try to violently open the door and then knock, thinking like, oh yeah, there's totally no one in here. Here's a tip, okay? If you just try to gently open the door and it's not opening, clearly somebody's in there. Why do you need to knock? Why do you need to disrupt somebody's peace and be like knocking on the door and then expect them to be like, yeah, in a minute, or yeah, there's somebody in here, or I'm taking a fucking sh it is not that hard to wait like a few seconds unless you are about to explode in your pants then you know what if it's just like one of those one person restrooms and there's two one for women and one for men just just go in the opposite gender i don't care just as long as you flush the toilet and wash your hands afterwards i don't care that's why like gender neutral bathrooms exist and stuff because i don't care as long as like something's open i'm not gonna be that person where they're like ew i cannot go in that bathroom even though literally everybody's just Disgusting. We are all disgusting human beings. <laughs> so yeah, that's what I wanted to talk to you guys about. Smash that like button if you've experienced that because it totally sucks. I don't understand why people decide to knock on bathroom doors right after they try to violently open the door and there's clearly somebody in there. When people do that to me, I don't even respond, you know? I keep them waiting. I keep them in tense waiting because I don't care. Because I have occupied this space. And I forever will not do that. You can wait a few minutes, if not like 30 seconds. Don't forget to smash that subscribe button, all the other buttons you can find. And we will see you soon. Alright, okay, bye. <laughs>